over the course of a growing season, one kernel of corn will grow into a plant that may produce more than 600 kernels. If you were to plant one acre of corn, you might seed about 22,000 plants. If each plant grew one ear, and each ear had 600 kernels, that one acre would have over 13 million kernels. If you had planted 400 acres, you'd probably harvest more than 5 billion kernels of corn. Let's take a closer look at just how this corn-producing factory works by following what happens to a single kernel, the seed. Using the food stored inside the kernel, the embryo starts to grow in the warm, moist soil. A primary root shoots down to gather nutrients for continued growth. Meanwhile, the germinating kernel sends up toward the surface several rolled up leaves within a shield that protects them. About a week after planting, the new shoot emerges. The leaves break through the shield into the light. With the leaves out and the roots in place, the corn plant begins making its own food, the stored food in the seed having been used up. Food is made in the leaves by photosynthesis. Photosynthesis uses light energy from the sun to produce chemical energy stored in the form of sugars. As the leaves grow out, so do the roots, which take in minerals and water to change the sugars in the leaves into proteins and other foods. As a result, the young corn plant grows rapidly on its own. The leaves, tightly wrapped around each other near their base, help support the plant as it grows. The tassel emerges, revealing thousands of small pouches holding the pollen needed for reproduction. Meanwhile, lower down on the stalk, the ear has been developing. Delicate, silk-like strands emerge from the end of the ear. Each silk has grown from a potential kernel sitting on the cob, surrounded by the leafy husks. There are 600 or more potential kernels, so there are 600 or more silks. With both silks and tassel displayed, pollination begins. It's been estimated that as many as five million grains of pollen are produced by a single tassel. That's over 5,000 grains of pollen available for every silk that is to be pollinated. When a pollen grain lands on a silk, it sends out a tiny tube through the silk that reaches back to the potential kernel, the female part of the plant. Male cells produced by the pollen 
move down the tube to join with the female cells. This is called fertilization. It happens over 600 times on the ear, once for each potential kernel. When fertilization is complete, each of the new kernels has the embryo of a whole new corn plant developing inside. The plant is at its maximum height. It will grow no taller. Food production by the leaves now goes toward the developing kernels. Maturity. The kernels have stored up as much food as they can hold. Four months after the seed was planted, the mature ear with its more than 600 full new kernels is ready for harvest. Harvest for feed, food, and other products for human use.